Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica. Today I'll be sharing with you a therapeutic art activity that will help you focus on your own path. So if you find that you're easily distracted by the external world and you're having trouble focusing on your own goals and dreams, then continue watching the video. I'm gonna share with you a really simple art exercise that will help you get in tune with that. Also, if you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. It would mean a lot to me. And lastly, if you want to work with me one-on-one, -on -one, I do offer online sessions and all the information is down below. So we live in a very distracted world and it's very easy to go off path on where we want to go and to pursue our goals and dreams just because there's always so much happening around us. I know for myself, this is something that I've struggled with and something that I still struggle with on a daily basis is being distracted by everything in life. We have social media, we have Netflix, we have people telling us what to do. We have so many things that distract us on a daily basis. It's hard to really keep our attention and focus on where we want to go on what we want to do. It's so easy nowadays just to look at other people and see what they're doing and be influenced by that. I know for myself, I sometimes look at my peers or maybe even people on social media and I think, maybe that's what I should be doing. Maybe I should do it this way or that way. But really, you know, the way that I want to do it is my way and it's going to be different than everyone else's. And so it's so important to not look at other people, but just to focus on where you want to go. You know, it's like that whole saying when you're running a race, if you look at your opponent, then it's going to steer you off track. Or maybe if you're driving and you're looking the other lane, you're going to start automatically going that way instead of heading where you want to go. And that's why it's so important to bring awareness to this because we live in a distracted world with a lot of different things going on. And the truth is it's not going to change until we acknowledge it and make space and time to really focus on our own personal journey and not be distracted by anybody else. As I said, this is something that I struggle with on a daily basis, but bringing in meditation, bringing in exercise to keep reminding myself to focus on my own path is really important. So in this therapeutic art exercise, I'm gonna share a really simple process where it's going to help you highlight where you wanna go and also take away all the distractions so that you can keep focus on a daily basis. For this art activity, you're going to need a piece of paper, a ruler, a pencil, and whatever drawing materials you have, like pencil crayons, felt markers, or paints. Take a deep breath in, place your hands on the paper, and begin to tune inwards. Say out loud or silently in your heart, I believe in myself and my ability to succeed. I have the courage to walk my own path and follow my dreams. I am focused, persistent, and will never quit. Draw a single road leading up the horizon. Depict all your distractions on the sidelines. Illustrate your endpoint with words, images, and colors. Create your own unique path. Cut out all the distractions. Draw a horizon line with your ruler. Find the center and create a road leading up to that. On the side, think about all your distractions. What are they? How do they make you feel? What kind of colors, images, and lines come up for you? Fill the space with all the external distractions in your life. Let it all out onto paper. This is your opportunity to pour it out of your mind and into the physical world. Now, think about your personal goals and dreams. What is on the horizon for you? What are you here to do? What are you here to create? Use images, colors, lines, and words to illustrate your values and what you see on the horizon. Now create your path. How do you want your path to feel like? What does it look like? Remember, this is your own unique journey, so create whatever you like and whatever you desire. Use images and colors to illustrate that feeling. Take a step back, look at your image, and breathe it in. Now, this is your opportunity to release all your distractions, to really focus in and concentrate on what you want, what you desire, and what you have to offer. 
Remember, this is about honoring your own unique path and not anyone else's. Use a pair of scissors to cut it all out. Breathe and just enjoy the process. You can rip up your distractions, burn it or throw it away. It is not needed anymore. Take a moment now and breathe in your path. Soak in the colors, images, and words. So this is my path and I had such a great time doing this exercise because it really reminded me of my original intention of why I wanted to pursue art therapy, of why I want to paint and create art. And it just reminds me of why I'm really here. Sometimes when you're in the grind and you're working towards your goals and dreams, you forget why you're doing it. You're kind of on autopilot. And so writing down these words and reminding myself of that felt very grounding. And so I wrote equality, connection, community, art, healing, love, celebration, creativity, and authenticity. And ultimately, those are my values in life. And writing it out here with, I drew a palette with a paintbrush, a sun, and then two helping hands. It just feels really good to have it down. And this is my road. So I drew some leaves and flowers and I drew some water. And I really wanted to incorporate the element of water because I really want my road and pathway to getting here to be flowing and to be free. I don't wanna be so rigid and stuck. And so I wanna be open to change. If something does change, I will just flow with it. And that's why I drew a butterfly as well because it's gonna remind me of the joy and lightness that it has as well. And it felt so good to cut out the distractions on the side and I just loved ripping it up and just reminding myself that those are just external things. I can control it. I can cut it out whenever I want to because I am in control. So I hope you enjoyed this exercise and I hope you try it out. If you do, I hope it reminds you of how important your goals and your dreams are and how much it is needed. I know it's easy to be distracted, but I just want this exercise to inspire you to keep going on your own path because your path is unique, it's needed, and no one else in the world can live your life or do the things that, that you can do. So if you try this, I would love to see it. You can always tag me on Instagram or email me. And in the meantime, I'm sending you all the love and creativity and I will see you next week.